Hello creative friends, this is Joy coming to you with another video um, with this is a flip through of a journal that I created recently and this particular journal that I created um, is made out of papers and the paper looks like leather and so I thought that you know was really neat to use on the cover of this particular book. Um, I also went around the edges and ink the edges with black ink. This one is a sewn journal. Um, I did sew the signatures in and there's five signatures in this particular book. And um, I used um, paper that was uh, from, it was like kind of like a travel paper. So there, the paper is really nice um, that was used in here. And I really enjoy it. And plus, I also embellish this book with some Tim Holtz ephemera. Some of the ephemera was big enough to actually use and make into a tag. And then I made other tags out of scraps that were left over from making this book. Um, so, as I said, I used Tim Holtz ephemera and also some other like. Uh, stamps and things that I had in my stash that I thought went well with this book. And each signature of this book um, I used um, six pattern paper, or I'm sorry, three pattern paper and three um, regular paper. So there's six uh, pages for each signature, which of course when you fold them in half you end up with 12 pages for each signature times five, so you end up with lots and lots of pages in here. And with uh, all of the little tags um, that are in here, and then of course the blank pages, there's lots of room to write and take notes and make lists and um, just you know, do whatever, you know, use this book for whatever you want to use it for. So I've um, been making these books lately and been having a lot of fun uh, making them. And um, they are just, you know, too much fun to make. And I've, I've made quite a few now that I'm going to post a couple online and see if anybody's interested in purchasing any of the books. You know, people might want to might not want to make one of their own, might want to buy one already made up. Um, I posted two videos on how I made um, two of the journals. One of them is just like this one but with just a little bit different pattern paper. And that one there I made for a work project and then when I took the book in to uh, show my boss and people at work, uh, one of the girls liked it so much she bought it. But that book is made exactly the same as this book and I did videotape how I made that one. And um, so I will post a link on to that video how I made that one and, and you can, it's basically the same thing as what I did here with this one. And here's um, a bookmark that I included um, with a couple of keys on the end of it for um, a bookmark for the book which I think is neat and again more Tim Holtz ephemera and um, more tags and just all kinds of room in this journal to to use for whatever I mean, you can use this as a, a calendar or a diary or just something to jot down your, you know, notes and thoughts and lists. You know, um, I guess it could even be used for, an, you know, art journal for drawings and stuff. The paper isn't really thick enough to do, to take any wet heavy medium. But it is drawing paper, the blank pages is drawing paper, so it's, you know, and these pages, it's the pattern paper, I think you can draw on them. But uh, anyway, so that's the book, and um, I hope you guys take a look at the video on how to make these books and try to, you know, make one yourself. They're a lot of fun to make, and I hope you um, 
try this sometime yourself. Thank you for watching. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.